A music student studying to get his master's has quite a dilemma right now. The instruments that he needs to perform were damaged on a Southwest Airlines flight, and now he's fighting with the airline to get compensated for the damages. Channel 2's Sophia Ojeda spoke with the student, and she's joining us live with his story. Sophia? Hey guys, yeah, the family tells me they are just devastated because as of right now, Southwest Airlines is only agreeing to pay $3,500. And the family says those tubas have been assessed at almost $30,000. <laughs> Dylan Jeffries has played the tuba since he was 10 years old. He got a full ride to Baylor University for his talents. Today, he's studying towards his master's degree at a top school in New York City, also on full scholarship. He usually flies Southwest Airlines when he comes home to Houston with both tubas strapped in the seats near him, seats bought and paid for. But this time, he says, the airline said no. Flight attendant went into the cockpit, came back out and told me that I needed to check them in. Um, and I, I begged them, I begged both of them. I said, please don't do this, this is my livelihood. If you do this, they will be destroyed. And destroyed they were. The damage to both tubas sustained in the belly of the plane appraised at almost $30,000, according to this letter. Even with repairs, they say the tubas will never sound the same. This was a horrible thing to happen to someone and I feel like they should do the right thing and they should pay to replace his tubas. Dylan says he immediately filed a claim with the airline. More than a month later, Southwest responded in this letter, agreeing to only pay $3,500. Dylan is now taking online classes, and without a tuba that works, it's been really difficult. Please just replace these horns so I can have my life back and I can go back to normal. Now, Southwest did issue this apology in that response letter to Dylan. It reads in part, quote, please accept our apologies for the inconvenience and frustration this incident has caused you. You are a valued customer, and we look forward to seeing you on board Southwest Airlines again in the near future. Now, we did reach out to Southwest Airlines for comment on our story. They said they are looking into it, and they are reaching out to Dylan directly. There is also a GoFundMe account set up if you're interested in helping Dylan raise money to pay for new tubas, you can check that out on my KPRC2 Facebook page and click to Houston.com. Reporting live in spring, Sophia Ojeda, KPRC Channel 2 News.